Hey everybody, welcome back to What The Face Glitchy here. And today we have something new and something old. So, the something old uh, that's coming back into circulation is autumn. And that's for a limited time, and when they're gone, they're gone. Uh, and I don't think I'm going to produce this next year. So if you haven't had it and you've been waiting for it, because last year it didn't come out, get it now. Um, this is new. So Fallen Leaves is our new product for the fall. And uh, it is an awesome scent. Oh, very nice. So um, I'll be doing this one in a bowl lather. And of course we always have our aftershave to go along with it. And I also want to talk about some other things. Oh, before I get to those other things, this other thing, something that I wanted to do. So, um, I'm sure you've heard of these guys, right? This is the guy who creates bars of soap. And there's tons and tons of fragrances scents for his soaps. There's just so many. In my CVS, I think it was, or um, I think it was the Rite Aid that we have, um, they were holding four of them. Okay, they, they produced four of them out on the counter. Um, and one is uh, wood barrel bourbon, which smells really nice. The other is Fresh Falls, and the one I'm testing right now is Pine Tar. It's in the shower at the moment. So um, this is the way the bars look. If you've never seen one, they're square. They're about that thick, and I will put... Do they have the ounces on this? If not, I'll just put it right up on the screen for you. This is nice too, this is the Fresh Falls, but it's a square bar. Uh, I tested it this morning. Um, it's a little difficult to hold because of the shape of the bar. Um, I'm going to give it another try. I'm going to use it all and see how long we it takes to use the bar up. Uh, and also what the lather situation is. So my first try with it I wasn't really impressed with the lather, although the scent of it, the pine tar, was really heavy. So make sure, if you do pick up any of these, make sure you really like the scent because you're going to be smelling like that. <laughs> so with that, let me get to the shave and uh, don't go away. Alright, so as you can see, here's the bowl, it's empty. Right. And this is the brush that we're going to be using, wet the face brush. Uh, this is the Occam's razor, and this is the Nano because you could tell because it has the hollowed handle. And this is the soap that we're talking about today. It's fallen leaves. So let's just take some and place it right, right in here. Do, 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 do. I put as much as I want in. <laughs> All right. There you go. Let me take the rest off my finger. And let's wet the brush with some warm water. Let's empty the contents of the brush. I am going to put a little bit more in there. All right. There you go. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start the lather. I'm just going to work slow. Try to incorporate all the places I place soap in. And then start to agitate. And now I think I need more. All right. Put 
Wow. Thick lather. Really thick. Me likey. Here it comes. Starting to get really, starting to really grow here. That sounds sexual, doesn't it? Oh, sorry about that. <laughs> wow. All right. Here we go. Wow, look at that. All right, so let's bring this to the face and uh, do the shave. All right, so I think I have about, uh, about six, seven days growth, so let me with the face. All right, so here is the Here's the lather. Let's apply it. Wow, there's a lot here. Okay. All right. Let me just dry my hands off. <laughs> All right, here's the Occam's razor. Let's just wet it down a little bit. Start at the bottom, here we go. So, um, I wanted to talk about a couple of shows that I've seen, and one of them is just released on Netflix called Who Is, uh, I think it's Aaron Carter, and that is quite good, I like it so far, it's a sh limited series. About an ordinary woman, will you think? She's an ordinary woman. You know, when I say ordinary woman, just a regular, everyday, you know, uh, person who gets up, takes care of the kids, goes to work, you know, her secret gets revealed pretty quick. I think that's entertaining to watch. That was, and I'm still watching it, and it's it's quite entertaining. Uh, then there's the other one, I just happened to check out, which uh, I've only seen a couple of episodes. I'm gonna check in and out of it. It's a uh, Depp versus Herd. So that is um an interesting thing. Because what they did was they put, they showed, they, sh they actually showed the things that were never shown in the trial and verified things that both sides had said.
I think it's a better way to get an idea of what was really going on in that household. And then uh, there's these, I think they were on Peacock, two shows. One of them is called Based on a True Story. That, that is really interesting. Uh, I've, I've seen like two episodes of it and you might like that one. It stars the girl who was in The Big Bang Theory. And uh, she's good in it. All the actors are okay in it. So I'm just wondering what happened to her other show? Uh, she was a stewardess on a plane and she was an alcoholic. Basically, she woke up with a dead body in the in her bed. That's I, I wonder what happened to that one, and you won't know because the writer's strike is on, so nothing is being done. That could still be in the works. You don't know. They only can show things that are pretty much been uh, created before then. Oh yeah, and there's another one that uh, is really, I don't know, holy shit. Uh, this one is called Bupkis. And it's a Peter Davis uh, series. Uh, produced by Lauren Michaels. It's got some pretty big stars in it. Um, Joe Pesci's in it. Plays his grandfather. Still great actor, an actor. Um, it's got the uh, the woman who played uh, in Nurse Jackie and in The Sopranos. Got her in it. Um, what else? I know there's a ton of other people I've seen, but uh, the first 10 minutes, you're like, oh man, do I want to continue to watch this? Because it was crazy what you see. But anyway, um, so that's those are the those are the things that I've been watching. Uh, here's the. Fallen leaves um, after shaving. Let me just shake this up. Cracking it open. Shake out some. All right. Okay. I think I gotta change that blade on the Occam's razor. All right, so I have, I have, uh, <coughs> sorry, so I had a great shave, and again, fallen leaves, right, and autumn, both available right now. If you want them, go ahead and buy them. No pressure. And I'll see you next week. Bye-bye.